So what we have today is another interesting piece from the Wanamaker collection. This one's in our upcoming sporting and collector firearms auction this October. If you take a look at it, it's an axe pistol. That's, you know, they got a lot of attention a few years ago on Forged and Fire. Let me pick it up and show you some of the details on this one. So this axe pistol started off as a standard French model 1833 boarding axe. You can see it's got a nice big head here with a nice sharp blade, big spike on the back. It's got a little belt hook, and then it's got the iron work here that holds everything together. What they've done with this original boarding axe is they've hollowed out part of the shaft and installed an octagon to round pistol barrel that shoots out the bottom. And we've got a really small, probably from off of a pocket pistol size, lock here on the right side, little side plate, and a trigger here on the bottom. So you could use this as an axe, and then you could flip it and turn it and fire or vice versa, whichever your needs were at the time. But this one is actually not an original piece. The ax is original, but the pistol components were added later. You can see that those components are newer than the ax components. But it's, it's a really neat piece. It might've been made back in the Victorian era where there was a lot of modifications to antique arms to make them kind of interesting curiosities for people's homes. Um, there are original axe pistols out there. The Swedes actually made a whole bunch of them and used them for boarding axes. Um, one of the things that's different about this one than most of the original ones is you can see the pistol shoots out the bottom of the axe. Now, if you were wielding this loaded as an axe, one, it'd be pretty easy to bump this trigger and shoot yourself in the stomach because it's aiming down. Most of the original pieces are going to shoot out the top. But it's still a really neat piece. It's definitely a conversation starter if you had something like this in your collection. It looks really cool in our preview hall and display with all the other antique arms in our upcoming October auction. And this is one of those ones that the second I saw it on my rack to describe it, I was excited to take a look at it and figure it out. And it's a really cool piece. It's really well built and definitely something to check out in our October auction.